I get asked all the time, where do you guys hunt at in Arkansas? It's always a really awkward question because um, when you tell people that you don't have a place per se, it's like they don't really believe you, but it's the truth. Um, we almost exclusively hunt public land and uh, that has its ups and downs. It keeps us in front of some of the biggest groups of ducks and the best water and the best timber that the state has to offer, but it comes at a cost. Uh, tons of chaos and anxiety and frustration and interaction with a ton of other people in a crowd. And um, when you throw a kid in the mix, it really makes for a pretty tricky situation. This is Tripp's first year to spend opening weekend of Arkansas duck season at duck camp with everybody. And it really forced us, forced me as a dad to kind of make a difficult decision. Did I want to get in the thick of it with everybody where the crowd was and where the ducks wanted to be? Or was I willing to go a little bit off the beaten path to a place a little less chaotic and a little more control of the environment so that Tripp could enjoy it and so that um, we could make this a positive experience. Sometimes I wonder what things will look like in my son's memory. What parts will stand out and what things will he remember as his favorite. I sure hope his memories are as fond as mine. I hope he remembers his dad and his granddad and his uncles. I hope he remembers how much we love each other and how precious the limited amount of time we get to spend together really is. I hope he loves this sport as much as I do. I hope the tradition matters to him, and I hope that as he gets older and busier, that I've sufficiently taught him how important and how rewarding it is to set aside the time to hunt with his family. first morning of the 2018 duck season, we didn't shoot as many as a lot of other folks, but we enjoyed one of the best hunting decisions I've made in a long, long time. We stayed clear of the crowd and the chaos and decided to prioritize the development of a new hunting buddy. These days I'm trying to enjoy the time I get to spend with three generations around a shooting hole because I know it won't last forever. 
And when we pointed the truck back towards the house, the big old tears rolling down Tripp's face because it was time to go home, well, they assured me that the next generation was hooked. I hope I can count on a lot more mornings in the duck woods with my newest hunting buddy.